Good evening uh, from London. It's a pleasant evening here. And hello from me, Dr. Dermot Hudson, Chairman of the British Group for the Study of the Duce Idea, Chairman of the UK Korean Friendship Association and Official Delegate of the Korean Friendship Association for the United Kingdom and President of the Association for the Study of Sungan Politics. I'm here tonight uh, to give a short talk refuting some of the recent propaganda against People's Korea uh, that has been uh, spread by different media outlets but uh, in all probability has the same origin, uh, namely uh, the South Korean puppet regime and the US. Uh, firstly, uh, you know, when I was look, looking at the uh, news on the internet about the DPRK the other day, uh, my eye was caught by a number of uh, stories in uh, tabloid outlets such as The Sun and The Mirror and I think The Express, maybe one or two others, that uh, people in the DPRK are being forced to eat terrapins or as I know them, turtles, uh, because they are starving, quote, unquote. And of course, this story is total rubbish. It's a, a distortion of reality, and it shows just how ignorant and uh, silly uh, the journalists writing these uh, kind of stories are. Uh, in fact... Uh, you know, rather than uh, people in the DPRK starving, uh, the fact that uh, they are eating uh, turtle soup uh, shows an increasing standard of living. And I can testify to the fact uh, that back in April 2012, a delegation of the British Group for the Study of the Duce Idea visited the uh, Pyongyang Taedong Gang Terrapin uh, farm along with a delegation of a British political party and we saw uh, this uh, very impressive farm with with the uh, uh, turtles uh, and uh, it had been uh, constructed on the instructions of Generalissimo Kim Jong-il who wanted uh, to provide the Korean people with a better standard of living uh, and improve uh, their diet. And his uh, policies have been continued by dear respected Marshal Kim Jong-un, who visited the uh, Terrapin farm uh, in 2015. And, uh, yeah, Basically, uh, in many uh, countries, uh, turtle soup and turtle meat are a rare delicacy. In fact, I was uh, Googling on the internet to see how much turtle soup cost in a British restaurant. Couldn't find it any anywhere. Uh, you, you know, and if uh, anyone can find uh, what it costs in a British restaurant, uh, you know, I will stand open to correction. But uh, basically, uh, turtle soup uh, is an expensive delicacy in many uh, countries, yet uh, People's Korea, uh, Korea of Juche, uh, wants its uh, ordinary citizens, ordinary uh, workers and farmers uh, to be able to enjoy uh, turtle soup, basically to be able to enjoy the same uh, food that is only served to rich people in capitalist countries and this is something marvellous and it's not because uh, the people are uh, you know allegedly starving and in fact uh, a delegation from the British group for the study the Duke Jardine in UK KFA was in the DPRK in October last year and the harvest was being uh, got in and, uh, you know, everything seemed to be uh, going according to pl plan. The fields were lush, and we understand from uh, 
the report made at the Supreme People's Assembly in April this year that the, the harvest was good. Now the other story uh, that's been doing the rounds uh, centred upon uh, the guidance given by uh, respected Marshal Kim Jong-un, the chairman of the Workers' Party, a Korean chairman of the State Affairs Commission of the DPRK, to the construction site of the Pyongyang General Hospital. And truly, uh, the speed of construction there is absolutely amazing. It's miraculous. You need to take into account that the groundbreaking ceremony for the Pyongyang General Hospital was uh, only held in March four months ago. And if you see the pictures of uh, the construction site of the hospital, uh, you will see uh, that uh, a lot of progress has been made and uh, uh, it is looking uh, near to completion. However, the media uh, seized on the fact that the marshal had uh, criticised some officials for some uh, shortcomings uh, that were revealed. And this was uh, uh, held up as an example that things were going wrong. But this is not true. Uh, you know, there's a lot of people who go on about, uh, you know, the need for criticism under socialism and, uh, you know, why isn't there criticism in people's cream? But in fact, one of the sternest uh, critics uh, is Marshal Kim Jong-un himself, who follows the people-orientated uh, policy, the people-centred policy, and he will not tolerate any inefficiency or any incompetence and he, he wants to see the people's interests put first and this is in contrast to uh, leaders in capitalist countries uh, you can imagine that some uh, you know certain people are uh, like uh, Boris Johnson or, or Trump or Macron or whoever uh, would actually probably seek uh, to uh, cover up shortcomings and indeed uh, you know the government here uh, did not uh, publish the uh, true uh, statistics for the uh, number of de uh, deaths per day uh, from uh, COVID-19 uh, that was uh, uh, covered up and a much lower figure was uh, published but you know the DPRK under respected Marshal Kim Jong-un following the people Sending policy does not uh, tolerate or compromise with inefficiency and all the time the DPRK looks to improve its work so you know these reports gloom and doom reports about the Pyongyang General Hospital are uh, basically uh, false and DPRK does not need help from the South Korean puppet regime to complete uh, the hospital as some uh, outlets ludicrously uh, suggested uh, when you and uh, you need to consider the fact uh, recently uh, South Korea uh, launched uh, a military satellite and by the way uh, where was the uh, condemnation for this from the UN Security Council, the mainstream media? Because when the DPRK have done this, they have faced UN Security Council sanctions. But anyway, that's another issue. The point about the uh, South Korean uh, satellite was it was actually launched from American soil with American technology. They could not launch their own uh, rocket themselves without American help so it's ridiculous to talk about them helping uh, the DPRK when they cannot help the uh, themselves I and mean, you need to think that the DPRK has uh, launched about uh, uh, four 
uh, uh, satellites, uh, as as well as becoming a, uh, an intercontinental ballistic missile uh, power all by by itself. Uh, so you don't you know don't don't need any help from the South Korean puppets. Anyway, I will conclude here. Uh, would ask you to subscribe to the channel if you're not subscribed. Uh, please support our events. We've got an online event on the Fatherland Liberation War coming up on July the 26th. I uh, hope you can uh, drop in on, on it. It will be on uh, Messenger or Messenger chat rooms. Uh, and so I wish you all a very good evening and please stay safe. Goodbye.